What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Ayana, the Crafty Notary, back again. Um, welcome back to the channel. And as you can see by the title, again, I'm talking about these low fees. Um, and um, this video is not necessarily about the fee per se, but it's about the mindset that you need in this business at this time in order to keep going to, you know, because there's new people coming into this business every day. And the last thing that I like for them to see when they are on a, on a, in a group is that the fees are all too low. And if they take them just to get any experience, then they get hit over the head with all these comments about you're going to run your business into the ground and you're the cause of the fee, the companies offering these low fees anyway. Let me say this first and foremost. The fees are going lower because the market is changing. The real estate market is cyclical. I've been in the real estate market for a very long time. It's a cycle. It goes up and it goes down. And during the pandemic and maybe the year before, it was very hot. It was very hot where people were buying houses like crazy because people were able to save money because they weren't driving into an office. So they took that opportunity when interest rates went really low to buy houses, refinance, get all of their financial things in order. And while that was a very hot time, everybody should have expected that a low time was coming. And I made a post in the loan signing systems group on Facebook. Shout out if you're in there. And my post t just said that if you make $65, $65 per signing, five signings a day, and I'm not talking about whether or not you can get five signings in your area or not. I'm just saying in general, five signings a day, that's $325 for the, for the day. Now, if you multiply that, let's say five days a week, and that's $1,600 per week, okay? That's not bad. Multiply that by 52, which we know no one works 52 weeks in a year. You take weeks off, but this is how salary is calculated. And for those who say, oh, well, you have an employee mindset. Well, if you're a business owner, you better have an employee mindset if you're gonna hire employees, <laughs> okay? So there's no such thing okay as you know one mindset over the other it's in my mind abundant or poverty that's it so anywho back to the calculation per year eighty four thousand five hundred dollars give or take now i don't know about you but i know that a lot of people um don't make eighty four thousand dollars a year a lot of people that are getting into this business did not make $84,000 a year before they got in. Unless they just wanted to change altogether. Um, a lot of people that are getting into this business is looking for a change. It's looking for a way to um, not be in the day-to-day -day, um, hustle and bustle of having to go to what you would call a job, okay? And I'm sure a lot of people will be happy with $60,000 a year, let alone 84. And you can totally live on $84,000 a year. So my point was all about the perspective. And I wasn't factoring in um, any costs or anything like that for a specific reason. So obviously we know that you may pay some taxes, but then again, you may not. You may have more expenses than you have um, in taxes due. So there's a, it's much more complex, but on the simple level, what I was trying to point out is that if you change your mindset to one where you feel abundant, then it will come to you. Trust me when I tell you this. You will manifest what it is that you want. And don't get caught up complaining about $65 lowball signings. 
Because then what you're telling the universe is that you don't want any signings. That's what you're telling the universe. That I don't want any at all. And that's that's what I'm trying to um, encourage people out here to do. That's what I feel like my purpose is <laughs> in this life is to do. And the irony is a lot of times I'm preaching to the choir. So quick video to come in and say that because I'm in the middle of my work day here. And, um, you know, there are still $100, you know, 125, 150 signings out there. That's not, you know, what the point is. My point is that if you're new to this business and you're just getting in, you're just getting your commission, there, there is still money out here for you, okay? Um, I've been reached out to by several people just this week alone um, where they um, have asked me for my help and they've asked me um, how could they, you know, partner with me and all of those kinds of things. So don't don't get caught up. Be positive, have a abundant mindset, and whatever the money that you want to make, it will come to you. Um, now, with that being said, enjoy your Friday. It is Friday, and some of us who do work another job. Friday, yay. Okay, so I know that's corny, but it is Friday. Um, and enjoy your weekend. And uh, before I go, if you're not in my Facebook group, it is called the Crafty Notary Network. Um, I've made it visible now on Facebook, so you should be able to go to Facebook, type in that name, and then request to join. I'm doing a Canva class completely free, it will be live on Facebook, April the 14th at 7 p.m. Um, so make sure if you're interested in learning something about Canva from me, um, get in the Facebook group and be there on April 14th um, at 7 p.m. Second, I'm doing the mock loan signing class again. It will be on April the 28th, it's also a Thursday, and it will be at 7 p.m. The class is about an hour and a half. I won't hold you all evening. And I moved it from the weekend because some people get in, you know, they get into the wind on the weekend. So it's on a Thursday. It's $35, okay? And um, you can register on my website. That is in the description below. Um, and I'll see you there. I don't wanna hear any excuses. If you need personal coaching or one-on-one -on -one coaching or mentoring and things like that, for mentorship, I would say right now, the best thing is to get in the Facebook group. It's still small. I don't have an intent to make this group like six or six or 7,000 people where you can't really get a really good answer on things. I wanna keep it intimate so that I can still communicate with everyone when they have questions. So. For mentorship, get in the group. I haven't done any in-person meetings and things like that. I just kind of don't have the time right now to do that because all of my free time goes somewhere else. So that would be the best way to get in. But if you want one-on-one -on -one coaching, get on my website and uh, the coaching is also there for you as well. So again, my goal is to help everyone succeed in whatever business you want to do especially the notary business so until the next time i will talk to you all again bye